Hello, once again, this is the second part of the main of definitions of some elementary uh, real functions. Mm. F index 10 of x, this one, is equal to x squared plus 1 divided by the integer part of x. The name of definition F10 is equal to all the real number x from R such that F10 of x makes sense. This is equal to x from r such that the integer part of x is different of 0. This is equal to minus infinity 0 open union 1 included plus infinity. This is the domain of definition because if x belongs to open one closed zero, it will be equal to zero and in this case we will get a real number divided by zero which is undefined. F11 This is equal to the square root of sine 2x. The main of definition of this function is df11 equal to x from r such that sine 2x is greater than or equal to 0. <laughs> we know that Know that from this is this is cosine and this is sine x positive or equal to zero and this part is sine x less than or equal to zero it is equal to zero if x is equal to zero or pi <laughs> x and projection this is sine here cosine <laughs> So sine two x is greater than or equal to zero. It must belongs to. It must it must be length. So two x must belong here. On this side. So first of all. Sine two x greater than or equal to zero. This implies that two x belongs to zero pi. So zero pi. Once again, zero. But we can take it is periodic, so we can take the 2k pi uh, once and twice and more. So, so, so 2x belongs to 
two k pi and pi plus two k pi. Then four k four k four k belongs into to z. This means that this means that x belongs to chi p p divided by two plus chi k pi and k belongs to z. So the domain of definition of n eleven is equal to the union k belongs to z or k pi and pi divided by two plus k pi. This is the domain of definition. If we take here for example k equal to zero, we get we get zero pi the first half. If we take k equal to one, this will be two pi, two pi plus pi, and so on. This is our domain of definition. How about f? How about the domain of definition of f twelve? I use amplification actually it is an equivalence f12 of x this is equal to tangent 1 minus x divided by 1 plus x uh, tangent of tangent of y this is equal to sine y divided by cosine y and this is well defined. This is well defined if cosine y is different of zero. This means that cosine. This means that once again, cosine x and sine x. This is the angle x. Cosine is equal to zero if x is equal to pi divided by two, if y is equal to pi divided by two, or equal to y equal to minus pi divided by two. So Cosine y is different of zero. This is equivalent that y is different of what is different of pi divided by two plus k pi. K, uh, k belongs to z. If k is equal to uh, zero, so we have y is different of I divided by 2. If k is equal to minus 1, we have y is different of minus pi divided by 2. Uh, and we have uh, the periodicity, so we have two, uh, two points pi uh, divided by 2 and minus pi divided by 2, and all uh, the uh, the multiple representation of pi divided by 2 or minus pi divided by 2. If we apply this here, this means that we need that we need that 1 minus x divided by 1 plus x should be different of pi divided by 2 plus k pi with k in z 
this means that uh, for sure you have to be able to write this we need that uh, once uh, more this will be different of zero this means that x is different of minus one this is the condition uh, which will be used in the domain of definition of tangent 12. So, we can write the domain of definition of F12. This is all x in R such that what? Such that x is different of minus 1 and, and and 1 minus x divided by 1 plus x is different of pi divided by 2 plus k pi. We can solve this, this uh, inequation. We can solve it. This means that 1 minus x is different of 1 plus x times pi divided by 2 plus k pi, k in z. This means, this means what? This means x times, uh, this times 1 plus pi divided by 2 plus k Pi. We take this from this uh, side, which is different of, we take this from this side, which is 1 minus pi divided by 2 plus k pi and k in z. So, so x is different of what? Of 1 minus pi divided by 2 plus k pi and 1 plus pi divided by 2 plus k pi with k different of k in z. So the domain of definition of is equal to is equal to r minus 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 1 and and 1 minus pi divided by 2 plus chi okay. over 1 plus pi divided by 2 plus chi pi k in z. This is the domain of definition of F12. How about the last one? How about the last one? F13 of x, this is equal to tangent x divided, divided by cosine pi x. <coughs> so the domain of definition of F13 uh, is equal to x from R such that what? such that cosine x is different of zero and cosine pi x is different of zero. So we have both equations. Cosine x is different of zero. This means that x is different of pi divided by 2 plus k pi, k from z. And cosine pi x is different of 0. This means that pi x is different of pi divided by 2 plus plus k pi 
try from z this means here okay, this means that that x is a different of one divided by two plus k and k from z so the domain of definition of f 13 is given by b f 13 is equal to r minus without what without one half plus k and and phi divided by two plus k phi k in z so we take off two uh, kind of points to be sure that tangent which is equal to tangent sine x divided by cosine x cosine phi x so to be sure that at the same time cosine x is different of zero and cosine phi x is different of zero this is the second part of the main of definitions of some elementary i think uh, real functions uh, see you next next time uh, in a new video about uh, parity even or add and periodicity uh, of a real function to this time take care of yourselves and see you next